saw this post, right? Only three people saw this post, even though my group has how many? Hey, my friend, Jean Serge Gagnon here, and today we're going to talk about what's the best platform to create groups for affiliates. And uh, obviously, it's an it's <laughs> that's you know just what it is what I build obviously but I think it's the best platform you can find out there and I'll tell you why in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets. So you might be thinking Facebook, right? Facebook is really a great platform for groups as well as LinkedIn. And there's other platforms out there. There's the Circle CI, uh, not Circle CI, but, but I think it's just called Circle. And there's also uh, MeWe that has groups in there. And there's a, there's a whole bunch of them, obviously, that I don't even know about. Like you can create group chats in Instagram, you can create group chats in Facebook Messenger. There's so many different ways to create groups in those platforms. Now the thing about those platforms is they're super, super active. There's millions of people on those platforms. So it's really, really hard to get your voice out there. Because you know, if I go to Facebook here, here, let me share my screen. Let's go to, oh, actually, you know what? I forget. Before we go into that, I want to remind you, if you're listening to the audio of this, you're going to want to go check out the video at cis461.jsgagnon.com because I'll be sharing my screen, which I'm just about to do now, and there's going to be a blog post as well. All right, so let's get right to it. Let's share my screen here. All right, so you're on Facebook, right? You click on this little group thing, and then you see a group feed that shows you posts that other people have posted on the groups you're part of, right? But what if you want to have your own group? You want to create your own group and you want to attract people to it. I mean, there's lots of people teaching all kinds of things about um, uh, creating groups in the, in Facebook. Like I have the, this this active group uh, users community, right? Which I'm post I'm posting once in a while. And I'm, uh, I'm, I'm inviting people that use my extension and things like that. <coughs> um, but, uh, there's a actually very interesting I got to answer this very I sh I'll do that afterwards but the point is that you have your own group and you want to attract people to it the problem is that if I post some like whenever I post these things right I get like look it says only four people saw this post right only three people saw this post even though my group has how many members does the group have not not a ton but 22 members right my group has 22 members and only three people see the posts right nobody saw this one the five people saw this one seven saw this okay great six saw this so percentage wise it sucks nobody sees the post why is that why does Facebook well first there's the whole interaction you got to do there's a whole uh, uh, reciprocity that's going on there's a whole but you know how do you get like what if you had a group where whatever you posted was always at least sent to everybody so they did at least see it you can have it sent uh have it sent emails or sent notifications to everybody in the group right what if there was a platform like that facebook doesn't do that because facebook decides whether the person wants to see it or not based on algorithm and based on all kinds of stuff like that right but there is uh, lots of platforms out there for groups now. I don't know about all the other platforms, <laughs> but the one that I that I created, that I built, that I use, is called Clicky Course. It's a it's a it's a course hosting social integrated platform, right? So the the platform itself has a news feed which shows kind of like Facebook, right? It'll show things like. Uh, new courses added new lessons added people updating creating their uh, profile pictures right now all you see right here is all me just posting uh new um a new uh oh, there's a profile picture right there, i mean it'll show an uh, updates and feeds and things like that right so also you see down here you see some details about the actual platform the income generated the sales made the number of lessons all these things but that's just the feed side of things if you go to the about page on the site you're going to see that it talks about 
that it's uh, what are their benefits of using this platform versus others and then when you go to the courses tab you can see all the courses that are on the platform but for and right now it's just you know filtered on some of the categories so I just say all categories I see all the courses with the pricing and everything else on there right so you can host your own courses on here you can do all sorts of but for groups all we got to do is go to more here and go to groups and then once we're in the groups tab we can come in here and create groups the thing about the groups here is that anybody that's in the group if I post something like say for example I have the click ecourse member here I've got four members in here right now because I'm this is still by the way a work in progress it's still being updated so it might be bugs as we go in here but basically I can click on a post and update I can say um hey from a uh, live video so I'm posting this whoops posting this during recording of CIS 461 episode okay so just like that I click on post right here it goes into the group and see it here you can add images and things like that videos but uh basically it's a place where you would post something now what happens is when you post something in here depending on the person's like if I go to members up here I can see who's in the group which is all just oh I guess it's all just me <laughs> um but the thing is that whoever is a member in this group I can invite people I can say uh, I can invite Albert Zallow here right let's say uh invite him and then I can invite uh whoops list all again and I can invite uh, let's say somebody else uh, Jasmine here invite right so now what happens is whenever these people see how they're invited if I go and I log in as Jasmine Tremblay here actually I can probably uh, impersonate this is a fake account by the way it's a test account so let's just go in here I'm going to go like this so whenever I become her or if I was to log in as her right you see there's a notification right here that says you've been invited to join the group so you can click on that <coughs> she would click on that she would join the group oh I have to give her permissions let's do that first so this is let me go fix that because um uh, groups is a feature that's brand new so not every it's not given as a uh, permission to everybody so let me just do that and I'll come right back all right so now that's fixed so when uh, you click this link right here in your notifications you'll end up on this page which we're seeing right here already um uh, so it'll tell you you must request to join the group but down here you can see accept invite so you just click on accept invite and now you're in that group so if I go into members now I can see that I'm in the group right and um if I go in the discussion I can actually post <coughs> hey another test whoops let's do that testing and then I'm going to say another test from test account all right so if I do this all right so now Jasmine which is somebody else is in the group and she's just posted something right now if I go back to my own account I'll just click on cancel here and go back to my own account and go into the group now it says five members right because there's there's Jasmine that's in there now and if I look at the note the, there's now I can see that she posted something in the group right so that's kind of how it works now you like I said you can you can add images I can go in here and I can say test with image right and I'm going to choose a file here and I'm going to put an image in there so a picture so we can kind of see what the pictures look like let's go back to here go back to here uh, right here into I don't know let's go into my what do I have in here let's go in here and let's post this oops let's post this one and let's just say did you know you can get one year free yeah, by attending attending the uh active group users workshop you can get a free free upgraded account for 12 months worth eighteen hundred dollars all right so that's just a post test but you can see what that looks like if I click on post now that I have an image here obviously like I said again this is a work in progress so there's going to be improvements to that uh but I don't know if I edit is enabled 
oh it's not okay <clears throat> so that's something that I'm uh, the, there's features that need to be added and the other thing is uh, without me talking about it without me having other people use it that's why I'm telling you about it I want you to use this platform I want you to tell me what's missing what things need to be worked on first and that kind of stuff right so you would just go to clickycourse.com and let's put the link right in here um <clears throat> where is it would you would just go to this this link here let's actually change the color of this I like I'd like to see that as a background of uh maybe more of a blue background all right and then the color of the more of a white there we go clickycourse.com so you go to clickycourse.com get yourself a free account all you got to do is go in here and then you click on register set up an account and then you can create your own group right so you go in, into more under groups right here and you'll be able to create your own group now what happens is once the group is created whenever you post things in the group the other people will get notifications if I go back to I probably should open up an incognito window right let's do that let's go into doo -doo -doo. oh this is right here I'm just going to go in into her account in new whoops in new incognito window and let me just log in as Jasmine 12 I I hope that password is the default that I set for these test accounts right so Jasmine Jasmine 12 all right and let's see that's not it let's log in and if not if it's if I can't figure out the password I will go reset it that's not it either okay so let's go reset the password I'll be right back all right so once once I'm logged in now I can see notifications up here and uh I guess the notifications are not enabled for the group but normally you would see a notification right here that there was a new post in the group which is uh maybe it's based on her preferences let me take a look maybe the preferences are not enabled but as I said these are things that are in the in the works so in progress this is the kind of stuff that I'm gonna have to look at and fix and see why that didn't show up um but receive notification emails right at right at way yeah that's not right email notification format other okay so let's see if uh, an email was sent let me go check that out well yeah so the notification of the group I guess maybe it's a setting in the group I, it's been so long but as you can see right here we did get the email Jasmine did get the email on being invited to the to the group to the course Click eCourse member right by me and then you can view by clicking on this to go to the group uh let's go back to the group here and let's see if there is anything in here that has to do with the settings so let me go into the group settings I'm the admin here so as the admin oh look at that there's an error again another thing I'm going to have to fix but here's the thing as as I mentioned so this is this is what the groups are now why do I say this is the best group platform for affiliates the reason is because on the platform you can also have your own courses your own training your own uh, files your own things that you sell right you can actually come in here let's say I go to courses here well actually let's become let's do it as Jasmine though if I go to Jasmine here right I go to courses <coughs> let's say Jasmine is you right you're the person that's on the site you're it's a brand new account and you're ready to actually create a group so you come in here you create a um, course you just click on that you create a new course right and we're just going to call it uh let's say um 1000 in seven days for seven dollars right there's lots of affiliates selling something like this so this is affiliate program course and over here you can say detail the the details of the course obviously you want to put things in there that'll entice people to you know want it you click on next and then uh, the type of course is either default or drip content we'll leave it at default and we don't need well we could put keywords in here we can say things like uh, affiliate program uh, comma uh, affiliate income um, online marketing you know whatever whatever keywords you want to use now this is SEO stuff right so this will become part of the site whenever you share it well I'll show you in a second but I just want to do this real quick I'm not going to do any of this I'm just going to say next the categories affiliate marketing let's make it affiliate marketing let's make it 
uh, traction marketing and then we're going to say uh, audience growth um, content creation digital marketing let's just put those in there let's click on next all right so then let's put an image in here and let's just say uh, it would be obviously an image that makes sense but let's put this one in here for now and next and uh, the price will be seven dollars right now the other thing is if you want you could you probably should put this at a thousand dollars or maybe I don't know let's say 297 right and then we'll make it so that the the there's a special for seven dollars so let's give a commission of 90 percent why do you give a commission 90 percent because you're just trying to build your audience so you want people to buy your course and you want others to promote it and we'll you'll see in a second so if I click on next right here um yep that's fine and uh done. let's just click on done all right so now we have this course which is not public yet well look at that there's another error I'm gonna have to look into these errors but um <clears throat> so basically what you want to do here is you want to add a lesson right let's add a lesson let's just make it one thing uh we'll say uh lesson introduction right whoops introduction <clears throat> and uh, then we're gonna have uh, the summary of it and all that stuff right so let's just say I'm gonna put a link in here from YouTube which uh, let's go look for my YouTube uh, my YouTube just put a little video in there like it obviously you would create a video and upload it to YouTube and then you would just put the link there for it so let me just find something to put in there let's just pause it and when it comes back we'll be back all right so it doesn't really matter which one but let's say I had a video like um one of these videos that aren't too long these are shorts a bunch of shorts um traction marketing gurus okay let's use this one so go here get shareable link then go back to here oh no not here sorry the incognito one which is here and we'll just put the link right here and we're going to say save I don't know if that'll work the shorts I never tried the shorts links so if I go back to the I probably didn't work I don't think yeah it didn't work so oh it did work okay okay so there's the short it's in there that's the video that's the less I'm just going to publish it and I'm going to publish the course so da -da -da. edit the course and publish it actually publish da -da 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 it's under access right here and we're going to set it to public and then done all right so now the course is published now what that means is that it's accessible if somebody else like say I go back to my other one here and I look and I just go well first let's look at the feed it, it, sh it doesn't always show up in the feed the feed has an algorithm as well which is basically show me stuff that is new but also don't don't show me necessarily everything but there you go so this one here is here and it's there now in the and you see Jasmine did it right so now if I go back to Jasmine's page I can actually come in here and I can say manage deals and coupons I want to give this for seven dollars right so I want a new deal it'll be seven dollars and it starts now there's no end date it's just a deal okay so let's do that uh look at that another error another thing to fix um so let's see let me fix that and come right back all right so let's uh, take a look so manage deals and coupons we're going to do seven dollars with no end date submit and now we have the new deals now if I reload this page and if anybody else sees it it says right here that's seven dollars if I go back to the other page and I go to this course oh I guess if I go to the course as me right which is I'm not the creator of the course it's Jasmine did it so if I go to this now I can see that I can get this course for seven dollars if we let it load up here for a sec so there you go so you get seven dollars now why do I say this is the best site for affiliates here's the thing if you get people into the group of your own right here anything that they sell on the platform anything that they promote any of the courses you get them cookie to you because you got them in your group so if you create a group that people want to join and are interested in the topic and they actually participate whether they participate or not actually if they just join your group 
They're in your, they become your referrals, right? They become your referrals. So in this case, I'm like, oh, this is a great course. I'm actually going to promote it. I can click on this here to get the link to it, which is my link, right? JSG instead of triple w, 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 right? Uh, and that means that if somebody actually clicks this link from you know anywhere then they're automatically tied to me and if they already have an account on Click eCourse then they're then you still get the commission but if they if somebody else does not promote it anyways I, I don't want to get into that that sounds complicated but the point is that as an affiliate you want people to be in your group because they need an account a free account on this platform to join your group and by uh, clicking the link so say I go back to Jasmine here and I go back to the groups and I go to that group that she's in now even oh I that's the other thing even if so if you allow other people to invite people to your group then they become the affiliates for your for you know for products and things like that that they promote and also for if I, so here's the thing if somebody promotes a product with their link then whoever buys that product with their link it's theirs right their commissions but if they don't if they come into the platform through your group through you inviting them doesn't matter uh if nobody else invites them to any anything else and they decide to buy stuff on the platform then you get the commission right so if i go back to this group here <coughs> i can actually share the group right uh, with jasmine as the name and then i get she gets the 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 referral to it right so if i if i just take this here or if i just click on the share this actually is going to have the name of the group that's got to be fixed too uh, like like i said this is a work in progress but the idea behind it is getting people now there's going to be so i gotta i gotta fix all these things obviously right so whenever somebody creates a post in the group that will notify oh, and that's that's what I wanted to see in the settings I forgot all oh, right there's a bug <laughs> so in the settings see as you can see right here there's no settings because you know Jasmine is not admin but you can uh you can actually give somebody else admin so if I go back to groups here and I go to that group and do, 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 do. so if I go to the group and I edit the members I can actually grant somebody admin rights right so let's go to that group and let's give Jasmine admin rights so under members I can make admin or make moderator right so I'll make her an admin and now if I go back to her view and I reload now that she's admin doo -doo 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 -doo, she's got access to the two things in the member list and um she's an admin now right and she can has a, access to settings oh I guess there's a an error in this oh right that's the same error we saw earlier but anyways that's definitely going to be I'm going to fix that obviously and um here's all the groups that are available the public group see public public this private group actually should not be visible to her I guess that's another issue there's a lot of little bugs but like I said this is a work in progress until you use it until you tell me what's most important obviously all the things that I'm seeing right here it's because I haven't used the, this feature of the platform for a while so I haven't seen these issues and I've been I've been working a lot on the on the back end of this platform making changes improvements to all sorts of different things because the platform has a lot right if I, if you go into more here you can see there's a WordPress there's public profiles there's an aff affiliate program there's a training involved there's a syndication engine and even if I go to the menu of the user right social links syndica syndication is there so there's a um, sites links invites notifications so you can actually invite people using invites if you want so that there you don't just share links you can actually know whether they actually visited so if I click on invites here basically what it lets me do is it lets me put an email in here right so Bobby 22 let's just put a fake a thing in here so if I send a new invite even though I can just send the link oh look at that another another bug so even though I can send the link to the platform which will cookie people to it if you use the invites once they work if you use the invites it'll tie that email to you right even though 
later on if they log in um, and they're not and they're just going to the platform using I don't know Google or just a post a random post with nobody's uh, reference then they'll be cookie to you and you can remind them you can send them a reminder here that kind of stuff to make sure that they know that they've been invited obviously you want to make sure uh that the invites are sent to people who know you right because that's not that's spamming if you send it to regular uh to random people um but yeah so that's that's the that's what the invites are for and like i said there's a whole bunch of other things if i click on uh let's see what else is there if i let's just kind of show you the so wordpress means you can actually have your own wordpress blog on the site right you can have your own wordpress blog on the site you can create your own blog your own uh, p pages it doesn't have to be a complex blog you can have a simple page that has your info your about info things like that Con how to contact you. you can create your own wordpress website and if you want wordpress is so advanced you can add things like funnels you can add things like opt-in pages like pop-ups like you know things like that where you can actually have your um you know your whole your whole everything right there on the platform for free the only thing is if you want uh the free account has limitations obviously but we're not going to get into that but yeah there's there's uh there's features that are available in the uh, paid plans that aren't okay so uh, then there's syndication syndication engine something i've been talking about for a long time uh the last you know month or two of uh, episodes i've been talking about syndication basically syndication is about creating content that is that you create one piece of content once and the platform based on your configuration based on how you set it up will generate what you want in my case i'm doing it to generate all these pieces right even more than that now but still that's kind of how i do the syndication right so uh, you basically just enter the title url the episode number the full text and then click the button right so upload the video that's all you do that's it's that simple that's what syndication is because you know leaders tell you you should be on every platform but you don't have time to create content for every single platform right you don't have time to create content that fits on twitter and youtube and facebook and linkedin so you create one piece of content and then you use the syndication engine to generate pieces that fit on each of the platforms like you know two minutes for twitter um uh, five minutes for linkedin and facebook it could be more could be 10 15 whatever then pin um pinterest even and whatever right you can do all this so this is kind of what i what i've done with this and you can do that too. that's what syndication is and uh yeah so even sites so sites lets you create your own in your own white label site that really uses the clicky course engine so with that you can create a new site and you basically give it the name you want and you set it up and then afterwards that's why if I go to uh let's go online what is it online course repo dot com I think it is is it I haven't used it in a while so yeah there you go so that is another site that I set up that is called on-site course repo which is using the clicky course engine as you can see down here powered by can we see it no we can't let's resize that a bit oh that's because I'm yeah that's there you go like this right okay so this will load up the and the first first time it's been a while uh let's just wait for it let's let it load I'll let it load while we do that but basically you can create your own site you can change the the colors and the way the menus are and things like that you can change um the features on it too you see the the way that this is showing up is a little bit different if I go to the uh under more you'll see there's different sets of features they don't all have all the features right uh site statistics on this side and ads are on that side so they're reverse and that's you know you can do all that with the with the and you can see there's no there's no groups or anything like that on this platform so it's up to you you set up the features you want so if i um that's anyways that's what the sites are for you can do the sites you can have it so there's no feed if you don't want any feed you can have it so there's no courses and all it is is just groups for example i mean it's really up to you that's the sites you give it the name you want uh you give it the url you want and if it's not a um well anyways yeah so you, that's what sites are for it lets you create your own white label site where you can have your groups and your members and you can even have there's even a friends feature that is still being worked on and other things like that 
um and then yeah so that's but still why is it the best place for groups for affiliates because it lets you control your affiliates um, process how that works you can actually set up affiliate courses you can set up things for courses you can set up all sorts of things and um, yeah that's pretty much it and so that's the thing right as a course creator as an affiliate marketer as an online marketer as somebody who wants to promote things that people will always see that's what that's where you can do it on click ecourse as the groups right so as you know once you're in these and once you're in a group like this right it's, it's a group that will notify people that will send them emails that will send them notifications every time there's something new in the group and people can add comments to it right so this is a me let me just say uh, add a comment here awesome right so you can add a comment and then there's a notify oh look at that there was a notify so I wonder if that's where the notify thing works let's see if that worked if I go back to here <clears throat> yes there you go see now it says user commented on and it actually shows the notifications right here and that means that a Jasmine will also get an email and it says right here notify students but I guess it should be notify members of the group so that's another because the comment code also works with groups and things so that's it's all the same so this is uh and then I can cancel here but that's how that works so I guess it I it's not notifying new posts but it'll notify comments so I got to fix the the thing so it notifies uh for new posts I'm gonna say I'm gonna edit this and um oops click on the text to edit it awesome great news and if I save that I wonder if that'll send another notification for the change I'm curious because that's something I haven't like I said I haven't used in a while commented on awesome no that's just the just the one new whenever it's a new anyways I gotta fix that obviously but that's kind of how that works all right so you create a course uh, uh sorry you create a group you get people in that group and then whenever you post they'll get notifications that you posted so that way everybody that has that's in the group we'll see your post like isn't that like so much better than in Facebook right where like only three people saw this post right then nobody saw this one right only five saw this out of 22 members right why is it doesn't people don't people see why don't they get notifications right why I mean yeah they got a lot of notifications that's the problem there's too much going on but if somebody goes into a group to learn something well they want to know about it you know yes of, co of course they could be going into the group every day you could have them have that you know thing but most people don't have time for that you want something that's automatic that's going to send information to people when you post in the group that's the whole point of groups right so go set up your account on Click eCourse and get a group set up and let me know if you have any problems all right until next time and and uh, yeah so that's it let's see you next time this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.